So I've been uh, spending my time tweaking microphone settings because I randomly get this glitch where it seems like half the time it corrupts my audio to the point where it's just not usable anymore. So I'm doing a quick test commentary. So let me know how the audio levels sound in the comment section. But a quick test commentary using the Duke. And the reason I'm using the Duke is for that right there. Two tap potential. Of course, I need help from a teammate or a damage booster like Kill Clip but it is possible. So we're gonna drop a rift down. This is our base of operations. If someone peeks, I'm gonna swiftly pop them in the face. There we go. Moving up. Excellent, one bullet left. I know I have one bullet. Oh no, he decided I was worth the nade. Anyhow, I like this setup because with Duke and Kill Clip and this Stag, I can always have an Empowering Rift. And so, I like to use Rampage on my Duke more than Kill Clip, but in the case of with the Stag, Kill Clip makes a lot more sense because I can 2-tap anyway in the Rift, so why not be able to Kill Clip run away and take that extra lethality somewhere else? And that's exactly what it is. It's putting the rift at smart positions where I know people eventually have to challenge. Getting a two tap, reloading, and then getting another two tap somewhere else where by then I might even have another rift. That didn't hit. There we go. Kill clip. Move up to where I see the little exclamation point because that means he's in a fight. Slide 120 to the face. All right, a little late, but we'll make it work. I am getting red pings here. I could have two tapped him all the way from over here. Think about that. Can't see anything. I was going to make that work. I devoured because I want to steal this. He might go outside. Ready for it. Crouching it out. He has to move. There it is. I have a hip fire mod on this Duke for that exact reason. So I have to pretty much reload as soon as I get the kill or I don't get another kill clip. I staggered it there because I thought I had enough time and I did. Alright, machine gun man. Oh, that's my teammate. Oh my goodness, if I would have failed there, I'd have been so sad because that was the whole team and we just lost him. Alright, so somebody left the enemy team, not good. I don't know why I was the chosen reinforcements for the squad, but hey, I'll make it work. Fight until nothing left. Oh, hold up. I might be able to kill that. With just the rift. He has to choose me. So yes, that did kill in a body shot. I'm using Queen Breaker's bow and empowering rift. So I actually switched this to the marksman sites specifically so I could body shot people with the empowering rift. So I really like opening shot on the duke just because the damage model. When you really think about it, opening shot pretty much gives you a free headshot if you just aim body level. And the damage model for duke kills in one headshot, two body anyway. So as long as you aim for the body, you're pretty much guaranteed the three tap. Get to my corner. I win? Yeah, excellent. I want this. I earned this. I just used my super for this. I'm going to try to use the combat sights. Hopefully no one's sniping. I'm trying not to shoot teammate in the back here. Wait for it. Alright. Rift up here in a sec. Duke, get up. Okay, so I would not have been able to 3-tap there. Now I can. Okay, that's a smoke. See what I can do with this 2-tap. I appreciate the invis pushing forward with the shoddy. You normally see people sit on the invis. That bow is really going in here. Shame I didn't have my rift for when I had the Queen Breaker's bow, but there should be another one up soon enough. And there is. Okay, so what are they going to do? Are they deciding to go in? Because I can drop this down 
and be really unfun to play against. I got flinched off his face. That's ace of spades for you. All I needed to do was hit that first two taps, so aim actually did matter there. Of course he was jumping. But look at my rift right now. Look at how much rift energy I have. There we go. Got this back, and it's like nothing ever happened. This is where I want to set up, because if I catch people spawning, they're going to run to me eventually. Okay, I see teammates fighting off with nades. I'll aim somewhere new. Switch to the other side. As soon as I see red, back it up, throw a rift. And again, another please. Now we can move. Thought that was an enemy for a sec. That scared the hell out of me. Hit fire time. All right, run away. I don't need to fight this. In fact, let's move to the other side. All right, so teammates getting a lot of kills, so I can back up to... Hmm, interesting. Okay, so they spawn middle of the map. Ace, I'm out. If he challenges me, he gets a duke, and he does. Perfect, that's my kill clip. Let's go help out Squash. I see he has a super. Let's see if he decides to use it. He is not. I have a Nova Bomb, so Spectral Blades gets hit. Notice the purple haze on my screen if it pops up. That means just throw the Nova Bomb at my feet. So I'm going to play another. I don't feel that I played too particularly well on this one. So we'll queue up while I talk about things. Uh, you might notice that Doubles is a playlist this week, and I've actually been doing duo commentaries with Drewski, and it's been going very well. Like, I'm very happy with our progress in this playlist. We're actually getting engaging matches with all sorts of different loadouts. Meanwhile, in Quick Player Rumble, I actually had a Rumble match today where it was all AFK players. Every single person in the lobby was not participating in the match. They were macro botting, so they wouldn't get booted. Quick Play has been, you know, a decent mix. I catch a couple teams of anywhere from three to six, all trying their best. As soon as they see me, I look at their loadout. It looks like something entertaining. You know, there's the odd scout rifle the sidearm whatever and then as soon as i'm in there they switch to like lord of wolves or something so we'll see nice to see that i actually made marksman sites work on this queen breakers might actually switch to hip fire now that i think about it yeah i can go for no scopes like this keep my radar open i'm 100 percent gonna do that so here's this duke a little closer look Opening shot, hit mark. I could boost this to 10, but I don't know if it's worth the coin. You know what, I'm, I'm gonna do it, I like you guys. Thank you for subscribing to this channel. There you go. Max the range on the Duke, maybe it'll matter. This is what it looks like normally, it's red, so I just changed it to pink. This retold tail is phenomenal. Got the best options here with rifled and full choke. I prefer full choke, but to each his own. Acarize rounds to extend the range, quick draw, slide shot to get some bullets back, range masterwork of course, Icarus grip to make it more consistent from the air, and just like that, we got a match. Enhance hand cannon targeting on the stag, got the grenade cooldowns so that I can devour much more often, distribution the boots with a swapped attraction if I ever need it, but I've been wanting distribution boots for an eternity. Because throwing a rift near somebody gives me my grenade and melee and a little bit of rift energy. So, very, very top tier option. I've been leaning more towards better already to get my shield back because it sort of turns every gun into 
a terrible version of Crimson. Or, actually in Crimson's case, it turns every gun into Crimson. Because you get a double kill, you get some health back. It's very nice. So yeah, I don't think there's a enhanced and flinching hand cannon on the chest, but that's what I've elected to do for this. I don't really feel like I'll need unflinching in the shotgun, but we will see on this match as I complain about getting flinched while using the shoddy. I'm definitely tired right now. I have been doing those doubles commentaries, but like I said, I want to make absolutely certain that this mic sounds good because I don't want you to be 30 episodes in and be like, I'm hearing a clicking sound. And like, okay, I'm so sorry. Anyhow, let's uh, push up to B, throw the rift at the door if I need to. Expect nades to be tossed though from up above. And there they are. I can't believe that was a headshot. I really am like, I'm at a loss for words. That was not his face. Got another one. Can slide it out. Oh, no, no, no. Back to A. No, you're running the wrong way. Time to devour. Oh no, they were already spawning up. Man, I'm just like thinking about how this went. If I didn't bump into that teammate, I would have been in the perfect position to actually kill somebody off that flag. Would have been a triple cap. You gotta have rolling spawn knowledge, my friends. There we go, I would appreciate that green. Speaking of crimson, there it is. Let's not get marked. Oh, I am marked. I guess I hit him. I did not think I did. I got bumped. Hold the crouch, hold the crouch. You can see my antlers, hold the crouch. I tried to blink just to mix it up a little bit. Oh, I walked into a barricade? Who put that there? I did not see that. Also, wasn't expecting him to commit to that level of uh, aggression when I had that much more health than him. So I'm going to go Rift up and B, and if they push, they get two tapped. That B wing hurts. Hopefully teammate can finish the cap. There we go. Once we establish map control, this is going to go really smooth, but we need to just rotate as a team from side to side once we get B. There we go. Not going to get another kill clip, but I do need to reload anyway. And here we go. This is where it begins. So Chimera just spawned. We still want a 4C spawn. I'm going to devour up a little early. Catch this guy in the pinch where he's fighting teammate. He's going to be getting cover for something. Slide it up. Fight him when he goes for power. I actually need to get out of here. The rift right here is going to be useful. There it is. I don't want to rift here. Actually, yeah, let's rift here. I have hip fire now. So I can do this. I can get away with this. Someone has to push me. There it is. I knew the hip fire was the call. Dodged right into the wall. All right, blinking outward just to move faster so I could take more advantage of the kill clip. And there we go. Two tap, reset, and kill the sniper. Jump up, jump up, jump up. There it is. I still get the kill clip, I think. Yeah, two shots is the limit. I'm going to go ahead and cap this for my team. I still have one more shot of Queen Breakers. You're breaking them. You captured zone C. That's a power I all, I'm halfway through my rift, so one more gunfight and that's a rift. Zone a lost. If they hurt me, of course. I think that was a... Spectral? Okay, so that's my Spectral. I might fight this now. 
I'm out. I made a mistake. Another super. I only have one Nova Bomb, so you can sort of see my predicament. This is where I'm staying. This gives me so many options to juke it or get out. Oh, and now I'm marked for vengeance. Keep going, keep going, keep going. There we go. Keep blinking out. Create space. Headshot, headshot. He has to push out because my teammates are... Oh, okay, disregard. Oh, nope. I might have to headshot this with Marksman. I'm going to take the opportunity to throw this rift and create space. Let's see who dies to it. Pay attention to where my team is. He goes left. I still hear, I still hear the swipes to the left, so there's my hints. All right, unfortunately, I didn't get to use the rift, but it was there just in case. Looking out wide so I can use this mid cover. High overhead. Guy with shoddy dies. Switch to this. I have the range to beat him, even if he has a pulse. Free fire as I back away. Blink up top and fight whoever's on B. Oh, that could have been an easy kill clip. Watch this. This would have been a two tap. It really would have, though. Thank you, teammate. He made an orb of light. That's going to transfer to me getting a Nova a little sooner. Which means a shutdown as soon as somebody has something. And now I can waste my Queen Breaker spell. Sliding this out. Oh, that's unfortunate. Just enough to make me miss. So 91 91. Maybe teammates can pick that up. I'm pre firing, expecting him to leave, like on that exact instance. Because I was going to reload anyway. I am marked for vengeance, so that's a little concerning. Here is my rift, though. And now I devour, back it up, and time for some Queen Breaker's bow hip fire action. Please, please, please. Nope, okay, back to C. You and me, Ego, can we do it? You and me versus the whole team. Nice. I need to blink through the door. This is worth it if they all push in at once. I don't quite have a devour yet, but I might be able to snag a rift through the door. Okay. Oh, I see me too. That's funny. Did not expect the snipe to be holding that when they have to push mid. Otherwise, it's like a free win on our part. I think this is worth the investment on a Nova. And here we go. Again, ready to fight. Who am I fighting? 50. There it is, 91. Watch the red pings. Blinking just to get there faster. Two tap on anybody. I think that could have killed if I got a second shotgun melee. It's kind of sad that I need two shotguns and two melees to kill supers. Like, please, Bungie, something. Devour. There we go. Next one, please. Walk around the corner. Make my day. That, don't do that. I feel like there's nothing I can do against these supers. I try my best to dodge them, put in damage, and they still get health and dump on my entire team. And I died twice to it. I mean, I could have sat on spawn and done nothing, but... You know, it's not fun. So I think this one ended up being another decent game with Duke. So I'm perfectly okay uploading this one. Let me know if you've uh, tried the Duke at home. I, I think it's one of the top hand cannons in the Crucible. This is definitely something I could see myself entering attorney with. Same exact playstyle. Just an anchor, putting in big damage, and leaving when you got the kill clip. To reset on a new area and push up. Yeah, I think that's like an excellent split for what I was able to do there.
So uh, let me know what you think in the comment section. Again, audio quality, that sort of thing. And I'll be uploading much more of these frequently. Thanks for watching.